what's up guys as you can see by the bear on my back I am taking Jamie a valentine today I got her a little car some chocolate and a bear I'm just gonna want to stun it and then I'm gonna want to crash it and then yeah, I can't afford that right now but if I get a little bit bigger bike you know like you know something that I'll respect more I mean not that I don't respect the 600 like I, I understand its power and shit but if I had something that was a little scary you know like a fucking bigger bike I wouldn't be so inclined to mess around on it, you know, I'd just like, ride it, keep it nice, your parts are expensive on it, on my face, I'm blind! on this bike because the uh, the subframe the ah, the little stunt pegs I got on there it's one solid bar that wraps up just goes up over the tire and any weight on it since my I don't know if it's stock but the subframe of the bike is kind of low so if I try to ride Jamie on the back or something it uh it drags whoa look at that douche what's up douche you're on your jigsaw. What a douche. <laughs> oh, sorry. Anyways, no, I like jigsaws. They're good bikes, yeah. <laughs> Anyways, I can't go too up on this bike. So I'm super excited to do videos with uh, me and Jamie because she'll have her helmet cam and I'll have my helmet cam. And la da da. I think our first trip on the bike when we get it is going to be like up to the lake or something so I'll get some lake footage and I don't know something like that maybe I'll bring my waterproof ca or case get some underwater stuff I don't know how cold it's going to be it's getting kind of hot so it might be alright but I'm going to try that um, and then we have two bikes it'll be more like uh, she'll, or Jamie will be more inclined to train more because then we could both ride together and uh, what I mainly want to do is get her out on the road like on the back with me that way she kind of understands like what it feels like with all the cars around how to take corners at speed uh, you know just stuff like that that I'd rather show her than uh, like let her find out for herself do 
do videos of that and we'll get like her thoughts and stuff for more riding with Jamie. Oh. I keep uh, debating whether to start over YouTube and make a new channel. Uh, I don't know if I want to. I just, I don't know. I keep getting mixed like emotions about fucking about YouTube because it's like, yeah, I want to get subscribers and get big and blah blah blah. I do that as a job, which would be awesome. But it's like I can't really commit enough to that, and then it's sad, and then I not saddens me. It just it kind of just uh, puts me off that uh, I know I could uh, put a lot more effort into it and possibly get bigger. I just, uh, I, I don't have time, so it just kind of sucks. Because something I know it could be a lot better, like I can do way better editing and stuff, but like, God, I gotta just put videos up, I'm always thinking about the subs and shit. Don't hit me, don't hit me, bro. I don't have time to do better, basically is what it boils down to. And then I feel like I'm letting you guys down when I don't upload or follow through on stuff. Wink, wink, truth or dare. Ah. I don't know, all I just say I'm sorry. Like, it's a hobby, man. It's not my job. I can't do it like, like Jake or anybody else big, you know? That's like, that's not the only thing I have to do, so the videos I do get out, I think I'm going to just do them when I have time, that way they come out good, so each video is a little bit more special than just some fucking random filler crap that you don't even care about. And that feels a little bit more fair to you guys than just, you know, yeah, I probably won't. I'll probably lose some subs and shit because I think I hung at me. I'll probably lose some subs because videos won't come out fast. But just try to remember, guys, the videos that do come out, I'm going to put as much effort into them as I can. So maybe a couple day editing thing. Um, I'm going to do cards and stuff and do more people interactions. Something like that. She saw me walking up. She's like, son of a bitch. And then the whole restaurant looked up and watched me walk in with that big ass bear on my back.